Montez. I'm right now the Wilderness Strike Team intern. I'm from the San Francisco Bay Area, but lived all over the place. And really happy to be on New Mexico now. And I was happy to find a job in the middle of COVID that wasn't just sitting inside or working from home. And so I spent six months basically exploring the rangeland of New Mexico. Working for Conservation Legacy, it was super natural to go from position to position, finding what I was interested in. If I decided I wanted to go work in the wilderness, I could because I knew who to talk to. And in this case, I could find the position online. I had the connections and also I just knew what I wanted. It's really nice to have a job you enjoy and that you have passion for. It's like, for being honest, Conservation Legacy positions aren't the highest paying out of a bachelor's degree, but it's really nice to have an experience that is based around learning opportunities and the opportunity to make a mistake. This is, there isn't huge amounts of money on the line and that you can make mistakes and take that as a chance to learn, especially right out of college, where you're not quite sure what you want to do. This can be a nice opportunity to go live in Montana, to go live in Colorado. My name's Olivia Kelly. I use she, her, hers pronouns. Um, I'm from Virginia originally, and I'm a public outreach and youth programming intern with the BLM. I did a season of AIM with Southwest Conservation Corps, SCC. That was my first kind of introduction to conservation legacy and really like the Southwest at all. It was really eye-opening. It made me have like this deep appreciation for public lands, for like the Chihuahuan Desert, and um, just like being out there every day, it really immerses you into this environment and makes you care. It's been great so far. I love working with all the kids. Um, I love teaching people about what's, what's out here to enjoy. A lot of kids that we talk to just think that it's like cattle ranching land. Uh, and there's so much more to it than that. So busting some of those biases that I think kids hold on to from their parents and from past generations and um, yeah, inspiring them more than anything. So my position is fully remote. I can, uh, I work from home most days. I go into the office when I can, but I've had so much more time with my daughter and uh, she has like, kind of blossomed so much and I know she, she just turned two so she's starting to talk but I've noticed such a difference in like connections with her and like things she's putting together being home more and it's a very accommodating story. After working for Conservation Legacy for one term I was kind of like I feel like I have a general understanding of the values of this organization and what they stand for and it's very much in line with what I believe in and um, an impact I want to have on the world. My name is Vinny Del Conti. Uh, pronouns he, him, his. I'm uh, originally from New Jersey and I'm working for CCNM as a Wilderness Character Monitoring Intern. Um, this position's been great because we were given a lot of responsibility uh, with this project. So basically when we're out here we're looking at a few different things, uh, mostly sort of human development type things. So for example, this trail here, we'll be streaming the entire trail as we walk and that live updates to our map that um, any of the specialists can look at fences, um, any sort of structure, and they all go into here and are recorded. Maybe a lot of people are like this, I don't know. I was hesitant to go with a conservation corps position at first. I was like, well, I don't want to volunteer to work. I want to be paid to work. You need to get paid, which is great. So it doesn't really, that doesn't really apply. But I was hesitant because I had this idea, well, it's volunteering, it's not work. But it's that's not true. The IP program especially really gives you a lot of flexibility to do things. Um, that I don't think you can do in a lot of seasonal positions. 